Was that was that you on the jet ski? No way. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I would I would not have stayed on that long. Uh, we've got some good stuff coming our way. Uh, maybe a little dicey towards the end of the week, but it's been nice so far. <clears throat> yeah, it's dicey at times, but when it's not, it's forty and All sunny. Right. We'll so, take that. including Saturday. So, looks like there's some pretty decent weather to maybe go skiing outside this weekend. The headlines look like this. We have the icy travel Friday morning. It's not a lot, but of course, with ice, it only takes a little bit. So that's early on Friday. And then for the weekend, almost to the end of the year, we're in the 40s for high temperatures. So when a bigger storm comes in Sunday night and Monday, at this point, I'd say it's more wet than white. There may be a little ice on the front edge of that before it goes over to rain but it's not looking very wintry at this point. We have 20s across the board right now, 25 in Plattsburgh, 27 even in Saranac Lake. So it's not very cold. Could easily be near zero this time of year out towards the Tri Lakes. A lot of dry weather on Storm Tracker, but some of that rain up over the Western Great Lakes, that's the little system that will bring us some freezing rain on, well, Friday morning. Here's Futurecast sunshine for a lot of us to start out tomorrow. And then we have clouds that thicken slowly. So I think it's a little brighter tomorrow, especially early on. And then we're back to the clouds. And as soon as 11 o'clock tomorrow night, so around this time tomorrow night, some freezing drizzle or freezing rain starting to come into the Adirondacks. And then it spreads east into eastern Vermont. So almost all of this is liquid rain in the air, but the ground might be just a little too cold. So. That's the concern early on Friday. Then it eventually warms up and it's just plain rain for later on Friday. But if you're going out early in the day, just keep that in mind. And then the sun will come out in a big way for Saturday to start the weekend. So in terms of the glaze potential, anywhere you see pink, so a little portion of the Adirondacks and then a huge area in eastern Vermont up through the Northeast Kingdom. Saturday's great, most of Sunday is great, but then the second system, this one right here, it comes in later on Sunday, either late afternoon or evening, but again, pink and green indicating that it's mainly a, a wet system with maybe a little ice on the front edge of it and in terms of how much over a half inch of rain is possible on Monday. So overnight we have temperatures falling back to about 18 in Plattsburgh, 16 in Saranac Lake, quiet otherwise. Sun will fade to clouds tomorrow, so it's plenty enjoyable. The range and temperature basically between 30 to the north and 40 down to the south. So here's the five day forecast. The impact icon on Friday is for that little icy stuff in the morning. Saturday though, sun 40. And I do think most of Sunday is dry. It's not till later in the day that some of that ice or rain starts to come in. And for New Year's Eve, which is next Tuesday, just a few snow showers left, quiet and cooler mid 30s should be for New Year's Day, Tom. Tom